Hello my beauties and welcome to my channel. For those of you who don't know me, I'm Steph. Um, apologies, I'm holding on to my camera so it's a little bit wobbly. I apologise. Um, but yeah, I'm having a bit of a shift around and I have nowhere to sit right now. So, <laughs> today's video is the first in a three-part collab with my beautiful friend and soul sister Anki. I will link Anki's channel and video in the description box below. Please go check her out. She's amazing. Um, so yes, these collabs with Anki are some of my absolute favourites. Anki is the queen of Build Your Own Palettes. Absolutely amazing. Her singles collection is like wow. Yeah. And it's Anki that got me into Build Your Own Palettes, really encouraged me, enabled me. <laughs> um, but yeah, I have a huge collection of single eyeshadows now. And yes, I thank Anki for introducing me to this wonderful world of Build Your Own Palettes. So Anki reached out to me and asked, would I like to do a Build Your Own Palette Halloween collab? Yes. Absolutely, I do. Of course, these are just some of my favourite videos to film. Um, I have got the shake, so I apologise if this is shaky. I'm doing my best not to. Um, but yes, um, so Anki is amazing. She's so, so talented, like super talented. She does the most beautiful, colourful, dark just amazing looks i i'm always blown away by her talent and she is just one of the loveliest people you could ever hope to meet she is such a good friend i i would have been lost without her a lot of times over the past few years um she, i just love her to pieces and i know you will too if you don't know who she is already so if you don't know who she is please 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 Go check her out, you are going to absolutely love her, just like I do. Um, I'm rambling on um, quickly before we get into the video. On my face, I did, for the first time, get the Ice Cream Beauty Box. Um, I'm now subscribed to get it monthly. Um, this was my first one, it is the, the Breast Cancer Awareness Month box, hence all the pink. Um, I have everything on this. On my lips is literally just the limp, lip plumper lip plump the amped lip plump from <laughs> indie beat cosmetics and oh my word yeah it works it really works i can still feel it now and i put it on like half an hour ago and whew, i can feel her working um so yes on my face i will list everything in the description box below so that you can check that out what i use should you wish to now i'm going to hand you on over to the very indecisive me choosing shades for the build your own palette halloween edition so if you would like to see what colors i picked then don't go anywhere okay so I've got a rough idea of the colour scheme I want. I know I want green, purple, orange, possibly another couple of colours, but we shall see. So I'm going to start with the purple mattes that I have here. Um, but I'm not quite sure what do you class as. Oh, crikey, this is where we come into the bit where I can't actually pronounce the name. So it is this shade. Yeah, I'm not even going to try and pronounce that from Glam Shop Island. And let's just put that there. That's more of a brownie. That should have gone in another section. I think it's looking pretty purple on camera. Um, yes, we have that colour. I quite like that. I do quite like that. Hmm. Okay. And let me just line them up up there. And then the next shade I have is from Sample Beauty, it's Eggplant. And that is going to go there next to it. 
It's such a beautiful purple. I do absolutely love that shade. And I do actually really enjoy Sample Beauty's eyeshadow formula. Okay, so next up we have Royal by Terra Moons. You'll have to excuse my fingernails. I did paint them um, in preparation, but I managed to smudge and chip them. So if you can see that, I apologise. That is such a gorgeous deep purple shade. I've got a towel over to the right to try and clean my finger off. I know I'm going to be extremely dirty and I mean dirty with eyeshadow by the end of this video but that is those three and then we have this shade here this is Duchess and this is excuse the beeping this is Duchess this is from Makeup Geek and I'm gonna pop that there it's more of your kind of cool toned beautiful they're kind of purples that i really love yeah i'm liking the look of any of these so far i love the look of oh this is going to be so tough so so tough um this is from lethal cosmetics it is the shade eclipse and i'm gonna pop that there gorgeous i don't know quite so much if that's really Halloweeny feel or really the the feel I'm going for for my Halloween palette but hmm, I'm thinking definitely more these kind of shades beautiful anyways next up from Lethal Cosmetics also is Night Call so let's pop that there Again, absolutely gorgeous purple shade. Not sure it's really what I'm going for, but yeah, gorgeous. You'll have to excuse, I'm filming in a different area of my house. I'm by the front of the house, so if you can hear traffic, I do apologize, but this is the best area for this kind of video, or filming this kind of video. Okay, so then we have Undone from Lethal Cosmetics. And there again not so sure that's what I'm looking for but oh, doesn't my hand look beautiful right now those purples and then lastly this is more of your cool tone this is blueberry from glam shop Poland and I'm gonna pop that there oh look at that that is stunning I love that shade okay so out of these, I think, excuse me, I've got the shakes. Um, I think, oh crikey, I definitely want to go with the Sample Beauty shade Eggplant, which is that one there. So I'm going to pop that in my maybe pile. This shade here, which is Terra Moons Cosmetics Royal. I'm gonna, that is that one. I'm gonna pop that in the maybe pile. And then this Glam Shop Poland Blueberry, which is this shade here. Hmm, do I wanna possibly put? I think I'm actually gonna put this Glam Shop Poland one that I cannot for the life of me pronounce um hopefully you can see it if my camera has needs but it's this one here so i'm going to pop those in the maybe pile and then the rest of them um yeah i don't think they're really what i'm looking for okay so next we are going to let me just move them out of the way going with the green mats so the first shade i have is from glam shop poland and it is washed olive and I wasn't sure if, because this looks a little kind of, I don't, I don't know how to describe it. But I, I adore that shade, look at that. Is it sagey, olivey? I don't know. I, I absolutely suck at describing colours, but 
I absolutely adore that shade. So I'll put that there. Then we have this shade here. This is from Davina Cosmetics, and this is Juncia. Juncia. This one. <laughs> Crikey. Cannot pronounce that at all. And that is there. Oof, gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. And for those of you who know me, you know green is my favourite colour. So this is going to be the hardest bit of this altogether, the greens. But yes. So next up I have Romaine from Sample Beauty. It's more of a kind of brighter grass green, I suppose you'd call it. That is gorgeous. And then next up is Void from Lethal Cosmetics. I don't think this is going to go. No, but just look at that. It's so beautiful. I do love my greens. Then we have El Faba. This is from Davina Cosmetics. Another absolutely stunning. Stunning shade of green. Look at that. Oh, is she pretty? I love that. Gorgeous. Ooh, if I do that, otherwise I'm hiding that other shade. Um, and then next up we have Dirty Martini from Makeup Geek. And again, another absolute. Oh, look at that. Gorgeous absolutely gorgeous i love that and then lastly for the green mats we have turtle bay from sydney grace this is from the in memory of mel thompson bundle it is stunning look at that okay let's be realistic about what it is I am doing today. I really love this shade for what I'm looking at. Possibly these two. I think, yeah, I'm going to put El Faba from Divina Cosmetics, which is this one, and then this one, which is Dirty Martini. From Makeup Geek. Do I want to put any of the others in that maybe? I don't know. No, I think. Oh, no, I am. I'm going to pop this one, which is Junsia. Or am I? No, I'm not. I'm just going to stick with these two. I think they they kind of fit the vibe. That I'm going for so I'm just going to clean my hand off and then we'll move on to the kind of miscellaneous mattes and the oranges okay so I've kind of got a I say miscellaneous pile there's two oranges here these appear to be the only orange matte singles that I have um which is odd well this kind of orange anyway so this is Bratty from Colourpop and move these down here and pop that there oh look at that that is gorgeous i haven't actually played with this eyeshadow yet which is bizarre but yes so that is that and then we have monarch from lethal cosmetics and i'm gonna pop that next to it oh it's more neony Oh god, how am I going to choose between them two? That is going to be tough. Okay. Um, and then I'm going to do the kind of miscellaneous ones along with the oranges just because there's just a few of them. So this is Among the Stars from Terra Moons. And it is this absolutely... It doesn't swatch as well as it performs on the eyes. But wow. I say that and then look at that. Um, oh, look, that is absolutely stunning. It makes for an absolutely 
amazing in a corner color as well so love that um then we have this kind of mustardy color this is oh crikey um i cannot pronounce that from glam shop poland excuse my phone going off um i pop that next to it that is that is gorgeous oh crikey well this is going to be a tough one okay and then we have also from glam shop poland another one i cannot pronounce i have the shake still um oh look at that it is this kind of deep brownie red that is so gorgeous look at that it's a real deep stunning shade okay then we have if i can pick it up um glaminatrix cosmetics bittersweet and this is a cool toned brown look at that that is beautiful and then just because i wasn't sure if i would need a deepening shade in there or not i have this black which is corrupt from makeup geek just so that i had an option for a black if the other shades i chose were all lighter shades okay so out of these oh crikey okay so going with the oranges i think definitely this one which is bratty from colourpop i think that's kind of the perfect orange vibe i'm going for i definitely want to pop in terra moons among the stars that absolutely stunning yellow do i want to pop this in do you know what i think Hmm, no, I'm not going to pop that in. I am, however, all three of these going to put them in the maybe. So, there's just two of those going out. So, I am just going to clean my hands off and then we'll start with the sparkles. Okay, I think I'm going to go with the purples first. Although, I do have this kind of miscellaneous one, which is more of a black one this is rise from the ashes from lethal cosmetics and let me pop that there oh it's that gorgeous kind of gun metal stunning i don't know if it's what i'm looking for we'll decide in a moment um so that can go up there and then if i go with the deeper of the shades first Let's try doing it that way. Um, okay, so next up is Grape Teeny from Terra Moons. And I'll pop that there. That is so pretty. Oh. Some of these, I forget how much I love them until I'm doing a byop and trying them out again <laughs> next is purple nurple this is from s and b beauty which is the uk indie brand and i'm gonna pop that there oh god these are a really nice formula actually they're slightly sticky but if you've got older eyelids like myself this formula is actually really good for not creasing or anything um yeah so there's purple and purple. I love that name too. Okay, next up we have from Glam Shop. Oh, crikey. Another one. I cannot for the life of me pronounce that name. So I am not going to try to. And it is slightly more flakyish. Oh, so pretty. Look at that shine. Oh gorgeous oh, 
so beautiful okay and then we have spirit from lethal cosmetics and i am going to pop that there gorgeous it is more of a kind of regular metallic -y kind of shimmer from it. it's metallic -y. it is a little bit i suppose it's but yeah beautiful i love that shade um then we have nox also from lethal cosmetics i think oh look at that Gosh, I do like to make this really difficult for myself, don't I? That is gorgeous. Okay, <laughs> moving on. This is Revolve, also from Lethal Cosmetics. And I have a dog hair attached to my hand. Oh, look at that. So pretty. What am I going to do? <laughs> and then we have, this is Rosette, which is one of the jeweled multi-chromes from Cleona. And, oh, this is, oh, stunning. Look at that shift. Oh, it's like blue to purple shift. I absolutely adore this shade. It's like a tealy, tealy blue to blue to purple. Oh, heavenly. Okay, then we have Fiona from Titmouse Cosmetics. I believe Titmouse Cosmetics is now closed. The UK indie brand. I think this is going to be too pinky, but I'm not sure. Oh, so pretty. It's way too many small indie brands closing down. It's so sad look at that okay my hand is looking stunning okay next up is ritual from divina cosmetics this i'm gonna pop here oh crikey look at that look at that oh this is gonna be so difficult okay That is looking gorgeous. Okay, next up is Enigma from Lethal Cosmetics. And again, I think this one's going to be yeah, too, too pinky, but gorgeous. Absolutely stunning. I am kind of heading, I think, for a more deep and like deep shades with bright and grungy i'm not 100 percent sure i know roughly what it is i want but oh gorgeous then we have uh hummingbird from glam shop poland this is so pretty look at that oh wow this is this is not gonna be an easy choice then we have uh, from popping glow uk indie brand juicy blueberry this is another absolutely stunning shade look at that oh so pretty so pretty it's got a green like tealy shift i don't know if it's gonna show under the ring light but oh beautiful and then lastly for the purpley shimmers we have aurora from beauty moon cosmetics and oh look at this are you ready oh stunning hollow shade oh crikey what am i going to do i think i definitely want these two and this here so the beauty moon cosmetics aurora is going in the maybes um and juicy blueberry from popping glow which is this one then this one here which is ritual from divina cosmetics 
uh, rosette from Cleona, which is this one here. Um, is that it? Yeah, I think, yeah, I think I'm going to leave it at that. I was thinking about possibly putting, do you know what, I'm going to put that in the maybe pile. This is Rise from the Ashes from Lethal. Okay, so the rest of them I shall pop out of the way, clean my hand up and then we'll move on to the greens. Okay, now on to the green shimmers. This is going to be tough. We have Vertex first, which is from Lethal Cosmetics. This is such a gorgeous shade. I love it more of a regular shimmer formula, but absolutely stunning nonetheless. Then we have Hawaii from the Pastel Roses UK. Again, another absolutely stunning, stunning shade of green. Look at that. Oh God, how am I gonna choose? How am I going to choose? Okay, then we have Moon Mist from Terra Moons. I have a feeling this is not going to be the kind of shade we're looking for. No, but oh, look at that. Super stunning. Super stunning. Wow. Then we have Lime Twist from Pastel Roses UK. This is in the original formula. I don't have anything in their new formula, I don't think. Or maybe a couple. But this is Lime Twist. It's one of my favorites. It's so stunning. Look at that. Gorgeous. Oh, crikey, how am I going to choose? Then we have um, another one I cannot pronounce from Glam Shop Poland and this is a stunning dark green, oh beautiful, absolutely stunning. Then we have Fauna from Lethal Cosmetics some reason had a bit of orange shimmer in it um this is fauna oh look look at that okay okay this is this is tough and then um this is blue lagoon from glam shop poland and, oh crikey this is stunning look at that oh so pretty okay what am i gonna do what am i going to do i really want that grungy green shade in the palette so i'm gonna pop fauna from lethal cosmetics aside oh, what do i want to do i'm going to oh both of these and that one I think I'm definitely gonna pop Blue Lagoon from Glam Shop Poland that one and then I'm trying to decide I think actually I am just gonna go with Vertex which is the one on the top left there and then we'll pop the others out clean my beautiful hand off sadly and then we'll move on to the oranges which is our last batch of shadows to pick from okay so the last batch of shadows to choose from are the oranges and i was amazed at how many orange shimmers i have in my singles collection um i didn't realize i loved orange shimmer as much as i clearly do so this is savage sammy this is from s b beauty which is a uk indie brand oh look at that oh that is stunning absolutely stunning 
Okay, I think this is going to be just as tough if... Well, yeah, just as tough as the others. Um, then we have Sundew from Glam Shop Poland. And some more flaky one. Oh, look at that. Oh, that is stunning. Stunning. Gosh. Okay. This might be the hardest one yet to choose from, I'm not sure. Um, then we have Glaminatrix Cosmetics Nymph. I uh, haven't actually used this shadow yet. I have only swatched it and look at that. It is green to purple. It's stunning. Absolutely stunning. Oh gosh. So beautiful. So beautiful okay next up we have axis from terra moons cosmetics and i'm gonna pop that there i've got a dog hair come off my hand absolutely gorgeous look at that it's beautiful such stunning stunning shades the shine the shine on that um, then we have Kindred from Lethal Cosmetics. I think this is going to be a bit too kind of peachy rather than orangey. Yeah, but oh, still gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Okay. Next up, we have what are you? Turbo Snap from Glam Shop Poland. And one's a little on the flaky side but absolutely gorgeous look at that oh how am i going to choose i have absolutely no clue no clue whatsoever okay next up from glam shop poland also is tabasco look at that shine I'm going to pop that there oh look at that it's more of a kind of coppery orange i suppose but oh look at that stunning absolutely stunning okay oh three more <laughs> then we have nectarine from the pastel roses uk this is a, an amazingly beautiful shimmer, one of my favourites from Pastel Roses. Beautiful. It's another one with a green to orange. So pretty. So pretty. The camera really does not do these justice. Um, okay, next up is California, also from the Pastel Roses UK. And, oh, look at that. There we have California. That is gorgeous. Oh, and then lastly, we have uh, Ready or Yacht. This is from Colourpop. And pop that there. Okay, yeah, that's definitely too much of a pearly peachy kind of orange okay what do I do well I really think that that is just oh stunning so that's from s and b beauty savage sammy I love that shade um oh crikey um what do we have up here um Glaminatrix Nymph, which is this top right one. Um, oh, I definitely want to both of them or just one. Oh, crikey. I'm going to pop both of these in the maybe. So that's Nectarine and Tabasco. Nectarine from 
the Pastel Roses UK and then Tabasco from Glam Shop Poland and then yeah I think I think that's it from them lot okay right I'm gonna get my hand cleaned off and then we are going to attempt to pick 12 shades out of this pile that I have here so just a second okay so this here is the palette I have to fill um, I'm gonna pick out a couple of the shades I know I'm definitely definitely gonna want in this palette so first up is eggplant from sample beauty I think that I definitely I definitely want um, let's move all of these over so we have them kind of where we can see them um, I think among the stars from Terra Moons, that's got to. I look at that. Okay, we need a deep dark shade. So I'm not sure. I don't think I want to put the black in. So it's going to be between these dog hair between these four. Oh crikey, like, this is not easy at all. I think I'm gonna go with Savage Sammy from s and Beauty. Definitely need that orange in there, that is so pretty. Um, more of the grungy green shimmer fauna from Lethal Cosmetics. That's looking so good. So good. Um, oh, I'm definitely gonna go also with Vertex from Lethal Cosmetics. Put that up there or... Hmm, okay, okay. Do we want... One, oh. I think this looks so good. Ritual from Davina, or Rosette from Cleona. Oh, I think probably Ritual. We pop that. Pop that in for now. Um. The orange matte, 100% want that in. Do I want this more of a kind of grungyish green matte? Yeah, I think so. So in which case do I want, I'm thinking more along the lines of one of these two. So, Or am I? Actually, I think I want, weirdly, the dark cool tone brown. Let me just pop that there. And the dark purple. Yeah. So I'm going to pop in Glaminatrix Bittersweet and Terra Moons Royal. you over there and you sit down there oh this is looking good and yes I definitely want what are you called <laughs> oh Faber from Davina look at that okay we're looking we're looking good which one out of these oranges okay right I think I do want to put another one of the oranges in, but I'm not sure which one. Oh, I'm thinking probably Glaminatrix Nymph. Yes. Yes. 
yes yep that's that is good and oh crikey do i want to put how many shimmers do i have in there one two three four there's only four shimmers in there maybe i don't need this matte but then i'm looking at it thinking oh yes i do um crikey what do i want to do i could go with that but then i could also go with rise from the ashes the more gunmetal oh crikey i really don't know oh um let me move this. do i need to move stuff around um no oh gosh what do i want to do what do i want to do what do no i don't need any more mats don't need any more mats so do i go with another green or do i go with purple oh or this the hollow one oh i don't know what to do somebody help me um oh crikey i'm wondering whether or not just to go with another mat Do I want to go with another mat or not? Help! Please send help! I don't know. I don't know what I want to do. Um, 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 um. What do I want to do? Are you gonna go with the vibe i think let me put that there Ooh, i didn't even say what it was called rosette from cleona what do we think of this Oof. do you know i'm actually oh. do i love it do i love it i think i do I don't know why this is so hard. Maybe it's the layout. Let me try moving them around a little bit. Because it might be the layout that is throwing me off. So let's... Um, let's take... Okay this does not want to work let's take you out of there a moment if you are up there um That's looking better. That is definitely looking better. I think. Oh, why is this so hard? No, I think I'm going to move that to there. Yeah, I think that's it. I think that's it. What a 
working, guys. I'm happier with that than I thought I was going to be, actually. I just keep looking at it and thinking something just seems off. And I don't know what it is. I don't know whether it's having the two orange shimmers. Maybe that is what is throwing me off. Maybe if I take that out. And go with the gunmetal. It's going to be too deep. Maybe it's maybe the green. Oh, I think. So that is a blue lagoon from Glam Shop Poland. That's it. That's what it was. <laughs> it's having the extra orange okay yeah i'm happy with that i am happy with that okay well i will make sure to pop in the description box below um all of the the colors i have used in this palette i need to think of a name I'm not quite sure what yet but yes so i am gonna head off and you will see the me me in just a moment okay my beauties i am back that was so much hard work like in a good way but it's so difficult to choose shades when you have the choice of so many absolutely stunning shades but this here is my Halloween edition build your own palette. I haven't named her yet, but this is what she looks like. You have to excuse me, I mean my uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles pajamas. Um, but yes, this is my build your own palette. I cannot wait to see what Anki's looks like. Um, but yes, I'm super happy with how this has come out and if you'd like to see swatches then our second video the second part in the collab will be up on wednesday i believe if i remember rightly and then the two looks video using this beauty will be up on friday i believe if i'm incorrect i'll pop it in the description box below so that yeah if you are subscribed and you have your notification bells on then yeah you'll get notified when the video goes up okay can you tell i'm tired i apologize but yes one last look i have dog hair in my palette of course i do of course i do um yes one last look at my halloween build your own palette she's a beauty um yeah so i i will think of a name and let you know when I do the swatches. <laughs> oh my word, I think I need to sleep. Um, Anki, thank you so much for inviting me to collab with you again. You know how much I love these collabs. They are just some of my absolute favourites to do. And Anki, I love you to pieces. And I cannot wait to see what your palette looks like. I wonder if there's any similarities. Who knows? Um, but yes. So I'm going to be on my way. You will find Anki's channel and video linked in the description box below. Like I said, please go check her out. You will love her as much as I do. I can guarantee. She is amazing. She is beautiful, talented. Yeah, the list goes on. So for me and my Halloween palette, I, will... I have no idea what I'm talking about. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you're having a great day, great evening, wherever you are and whatever you're doing. I hope you're taking care of yourselves. I will see you again very, very soon in a couple of days. <laughs> Bye. Yeah. Stepping in the spa like she own it. Looking like the world is your runway. She can set it off like a gunplay. Oh my. Yeah. Talk of the city with the party. Always getting praised like it's Sunday. She said, baby, what you gonna do about it?